no, 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 no. Are you freaking kidding me, man? What is this that I'm looking at? The Broncos re-signed Melvin Gordon to a one-year, about $5 million. Are you serious, man? Are you serious, George Payton? That's the one thing we didn't want. Devontae's never going to get the full rock, man. This guy has potential. He should be the running back number one. And now we're going to do go back to 60-40 Melvin Gordon. Are you kidding me, bro? Oh, my God. This team just does not want Devontae to get the rock. I know for sure we're not getting a running back in that second round now because there was a big rumor we were trying to get James Cook from Georgia. But what do I have to say to this, guys? I'm disappointed. I'm disappointed in Peyton. Why? This is one of the rare Peyton L's. You got to be kidding me, man. You got to be kidding me. I know Raider fans are happy. They love seeing Melvin Gordon cause us pain. This guy fumbled three times last year. He fumbled against Washington. You're lucky that shit didn't cost us. He fumbled against the Eagles for a scoop and score. And then the worst one of all, very last game of the season, first week 18 game. And guess what happens? This, this motherfucker was running, gets clipped, gets fucking pounded, and he loses the ball. Fucking Nick Bolton from the Chiefs scoops it and scores. Drew Locke tried his best to catch up, and he didn't make it. Just fantastic. If I see that one more time, I swear to God, I don't want to see that. And this schedule is harder this year. We got to face the Rams with Cooper Cup. We got to face freaking... We got to face Tennessee. I'm, I don't know about San Fran, Seattle, Arizona. Like, come on, man. This schedule is harder this year. We got to face Baltimore again. And the reason why they finished last last year is because they had a... Empty squad? Are you kidding me? <sighs> I just don't know what to say, man. I really don't. I honestly don't. The only thing I got to say is a lot of people saying this is a decent signing. To Bronco fans, this is this is literally splitting the country. Some This side says nice signing. This side says no, we don't want them. And to be honest, I'm on the side that I really don't want them. Because this guy fumbles at the worst possible time. It's not how many times he fumbles, because it's average for a running back. It's when he fumbles. It's when he fumbles that matters. It's when he fumbles. I hope, I really hope, I really hope George Payton knows what he's doing. I really hope so, because you just brought back this guy. Out of all the weeks I haven't heard a single word about Melvin Gordon, it pops up now. This better... You're lucky that this is a somewhat cheap deal, but still, man. Now, I honestly don't know what we're going to do in the draft. I honestly don't know. Like, what is it now? What do we do? What do we do, man? This is a this is a L signing, in my opinion. Like, I don't like this guy when he fumbled. Like, in his first year with Denver, he didn't fumble that bad. He actually didn't fumble like this. He actually didn't. The only one, like, so-called fumble was the one against the Dolphins, but we won that game. But this year, oh, no. I've seen this shit happen twice. And what? Is three, this year is going to be three years then. I wonder who's going to be again. I bet both of them is going to be against the Chiefs, and one of them is going to be against the Raiders. <sighs> George Payton really brought back Melvin Gordon. All I got to say is we'll just see what happens. I hope he proves me wrong and I see Gordon and Javante. Because I remember early in the season, I was praising Gordon and Javante. Because they were really arguably the best running back duo in the league because they were both consistent. But now Melvin Gordon's back. What do I have to say? To say welcome back to Denver, I guess. But he better, I'm telling you, he better fix that fumble problem. If he could fix that, then I wouldn't mind him. But he's back, so Gordon and Javante is going to be splitting it again. I don't get it. We have a great quarterback. Why can't we just have a number one running back? I would love that. I want to see more of Javante, but don't look like that's going to happen. But we'll see what happens, guys. 
Peace out. Go Broncos. And George Payton, why? Just why?